Sunday School, April 16th, 2023. Joseph and Jealousy. It comes from Genesis 37, the first 11 verses. And the memory verse comes from 1 Corinthians 13, verse 4. Love is patient. Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. So Joseph, who is one of the 12 sons of who? Jacob, that's right, whose name was changed to Israel. And he was the favorite. Do you remember we were talking about Jacob and Esau, and we said that Isaac and Rebekah sinned by having favorites? Well, now Jacob has a favorite too. Well, you know, Joseph was born when he was old, and Joseph was the firstborn of his favorite wife, and, and his favorite wife had died right after Benjamin was born, and Joseph was just, all oh, just so special to Israel, or Jacob, and he favored him, and it made for bad relationships in their house. So one day when Joseph was 17 years old, that's a little bit older than Nathan Bloxham. You guys all know Nathan. He helps with Rec. A little bit older than that. He was out taking care of the flocks of sheep with his brothers, with his brothers, the sons of Zilpah and Bilhah. And they did something bad. And he went home and told dad about it. Tattling ever happen to you? Ever, ever think that you're being cheated so you go and tell your parents, do you know what she just did? Remember, you've done that before, right? Tattling. And because he told dad what they did, they hated him. They just hated him. And then to make it worse, Jacob or Israel, however you want to call him, made Joseph the most beautiful robe. Oh, it was all colors and it was ornate. It was just beautiful, embroidered perhaps, or with a special collar on it. Oh, it was so, so nice. And he didn't make one for the other kids. He could have. If you make one for one kid, don't you think you could make it for the others? He didn't. He just made one for Joseph and Joseph wore it. And his brothers hated him for it because they knew that daddy loved Joseph more than he loved them. And there was nothing they could do to make it better. And then third thing Joseph did to make them hate him is he had a dream. And in the dream, there were these sheaves of grain that were standing up in a field. And then his sheaf rose up higher and the other 11 sheaves all bowed down to his. Bowed down to his. And he told his brothers. And when he told them, they said, You think we're going to bow down to you? No way. And they hated him even more. And then a few nights later, he had another dream. And in this dream, there was the sun and the moon. And there were the stars. 12 stars, of course, and the sun, the moon, and 11 stars bow down to Joseph's star. And even his dad said, Joseph, do you actually think your mother and I would bow down to you? Surely not. But Israel remembered these dreams because they meant something. So the memory verse again is love is patient Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. Who do you think might have been proud in this story? Proud of his new coat. Proud that dad loved him the most. Maybe Joseph, right? Who do you think might have been envious? It does not envy. Envy means want something that somebody else has think the brothers were jealous because he had the beautiful coat? 
Love is patient. Was Joseph patient with his brothers? Were they patient with him? Love is kind. Was Joseph kind to them? Were they kind back? Let's say it again. Love is patient. Love is kind. This is a P, this is a K. Love is patient. Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. It comes from 1 Corinthians 13, 4. Dear Father God, help us to be able to say, I am patient. I am kind. I do not envy. I do not boast. I am not proud. Because we are filled with your love, especially for our brothers and sisters. In Jesus' name, amen.